Shalom, and it's so good to have you join us for our meditation and for our daily devotional. We trust and pray that the presence of the Lord is something that you are experiencing tangibly as we go through the series of activating God's presence. In our daily lives, we face challenges, we face temptations that often make us lose our focus on what is truly important. However, when we are obedient to God's word, we attract His presence in our lives in very powerful ways. So obedience to God is a way to, be, to activate His presence in our lives. When we read through the account of the Israelites in the wilderness in Exodus, we see that they obeyed God, and when they obeyed God, the presence of God went with them. The pillar of cloud by day and the pillar of fire by night. Isn't it amazing to just think about how the presence of the Lord led them through the wilderness day by day? The people of Israelites were called to obey. Just like that, when we follow His commands and His teachings, and we keep it close to our hearts, we attract the presence of, of God. When we are obedient, we are also in alignment with God's will. And this creates not just a, a sense of peace and security, even in the midst of an uncertainty, but it brings about a place where we draw near to God and allow Him to work in us in amazing ways. However, obedience is not always easy. It means to keep aside, to put aside our own will or our own desires. But we know that the reward is well worth the effort. When we are obedient, we experience the power of God's presence. We experience His might in our lives. He blesses us with peace, with joy, a sense of purpose that is unmatched to anything else that we can have. So how can we be more obedient to God's word? So we go back to the principle of meditation, principle of prayer and study of God's word. We need to immerse ourselves in His Word so that it can shape our thoughts and actions. So even when we are called to a point to do something, we do it out of obedience to God. We seek that accountability even from those fellow believers that we stay in line and tune with God's Word. So obedience to God attracts His presence into our lives. It brings us peace. It brings us joy. It brings us purpose. So let's make a commitment today to read His Word, to be, meditate on His Word so that we can obey His Word and thereby sense and feel and have His presence with us. Let's pray together. Heavenly Father, we pray that You will teach us to be obedient children, children who will follow after You and Your commands and Your precepts. Father, so that we will have your presence like the Israelites, Lord, the pillar of cloud and the pillar of fire, Lord, moment after moment. Thank you, God, that you love obedience, you love obedient hearts. May we, Lord, live in accordance to your principles. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.